Hey everyone, it's Linda with Scrap Chica Studio bringing you a really quick video here. Um, if you're wondering where I've been, <laughs> um, I have been this past weekend at the Creating Keepsake Scrapbook Convention here in Mesa. Um, I had a lot of fun with my friends going and I bought a little bit of stuff. Didn't spend a lot of money this time. Um, not that I have a lot of money, but I was really careful and bought some really cool stuff. Um, I will be doing a video on um, what I've gotten, and it's just a little bit. It's it's not very much. Um, but there's this new company called Kiwi Designs, and they have a really cool little um, system. So check them out. I even heard they had YouTube videos. I did not know that, so I will be checking them out. Um, Kiwi Designs and that's what they're called so check them out and um, I wanted to bring you some news of Crafty X and she is Zoe. Hi Zoe. Um, she is giving away a big giveaway you guys um, for a thank you and 500 subby um, kind of thing going on on her blog and here on YouTube. Her YouTube name is AF0093 and her blog spot is craftyx.blogspot.com and I will put a link down below um, with that information. You guys, she has given away a gypsy, you guys. A gypsy! <laughs> um, that is totally awesome and that is fantastic. That is such a great giveaway. Um, you have to be a subscriber um, here on YouTube um, under her channel and you have and comment on the video that she has a video um, and then you have another chance if you go to her blog and comment on she put the video there comment on the video and also be a, a follower on her blog so I mean that is such a cool giveaway check her out you guys um, I'm here bringing you a little project that I've been working on in between disappearing over the weekend. <laughs> I had a lot of fun. I had a great weekend. Um, this is a Tim Holtz configuration box and I have changed it up a little. I did not go the the whole vintage Tim Holtz grunge look. I think a lot of people um, are doing that. So I, I changed it up a little bit and did like um, kind of doll more girly type thing and I love how it came out I used a new um, collection that is by Sassafras and I want to say it's called Sweetly Smitten but I'm not sure but I'll I'll find out what it is and I'll put it down below um, it's really cute the paper line it's more of a shabby kind of feel and so this is what I did my box is more of a shabby um, kind of thing and yes there are, there's little clothes dangling in there on hangers <laughs> I know I don't know what went through my mind um, creating this but I had a lot of fun um, just you know picking the little things out for it so let me go over that up here on top let me get this over here I have the word Feliz uh, which is happy in Spanish um, I did the letters off my Cricut. I put some little uh, Recollection Roses in here, a uh, little Michael's bird uh, down there, and I just kind of inked it up to give it more of a kind of grunge little look. Um, in the first little panel here, uh, I have a greeting farm image that's Flirty Anya. Down that what she's standing on is a Recollections flower which is a doily crochet doily and it totally looks like a little rug so it, it reminded me of little rug so that's why I have it down there um, the little bottle um, ah, right here is the Tim Holtz uh, corked vials and totally look like a little vase and put some more little roses in there uh, in the back there she has a little wooden dresser um, on there she has her own little telephone and a little bottle of perfume I have a little uh, photo frame in there and if you can see that's a picture of my husband hi Miguel <laughs> over here uh, on the upper part of her closet she has um, little purses and what little lady you know 
doesn't love her little handbags and use some of those recollection um, resin flowers there on some of them and down here her little closet I used a dowel um, you can see up there just a not a dowel a skewer a little bamboo skewer um, and I used the Tim Holtz um, hanger clips and those are from his new line and I made her some cute little clothes um, did that off the Cricut and here I have her uh, little pair of shoes um, on the next one is a little bed it has a little um, pattern paper for like a quilt or a bed you know cover and a little teddy bear um, I use some lace that I have or I should say yeah trim I don't I think it's lace because it's kind of thicker than lace so it's some kind of trim I had um, here you can see I put some more of the flowers and used the stems and coiled them around the um, just to make them coily um, there's a piece of recollections bling and Martha Stewart butterfly and that's uh, what I did on the side here again and it's a wall hanging and I used some sheer ribbon um, I don't know if you can see that on top um, it's just so that you could hang it on the wall so once it hangs on the wall you, you get this and I'm so pleased at how it came out. I have a couple more ideas for some more. Um, I'll be, I'll have this on my blog and kind of what I did, um, what I used to make the box like this. So this is what I've been doing. I have some more um, projects that I'll be sharing with you, some swaps that I'm in. And that's it. And check out Zoe at uh, AF0093 here on YouTube and, or on her blog at craftyx.blogspot.com and for my box you can check it out at scrapchica.blogspot.com. Hope you guys are having a scrappy good time and I will see y'all later. Adios!